वेलकम टू दिस लेक्चर वी हैव अ स्लाइट इशू ऑन आवर हैंड्स इफ वी कॉल वोकलाइज मेथड ऑन आवर इंस्टेंसेस दे ऑल हैव द सेम बिहेवियर लाइक दिस चीता डॉट वोकलाइज रिजल्ट चफ लैपेड डॉट वोकलाइज मेथड रिजल्ट चफ एंड लाइन डॉट वोकलाइज मेथड रिजल्ट चफ इन रियलिटी रियलिटी चीता मेक्स अ चिप बर्ड लाइक साउंड वाई लाइन्स एंड लैपेड रोर We can rectify this by overriding the method in our child classes. Overriding means redefining the implementation of a method defined in a superclass to add or change a subclass functionality. Override the vocalized method for our subclass. Start class cat. Define a class cat. Define the constructor of cat class with the with the attributes mass, lifespan, and speed. Define vocalized method to capture the voice of cat. Define Define vocalize method. Print chap. Define the print facts method to print the facts about a cat. This this method will print out the mass in kg, lifespan in years, and speed in per kilometer per hour attributes. End of class cat. Class cheetah of cat. Class cheetah of cat. Cheetah is child class. Cat is parent class. Override the vocalize method to change its output or behavior for the voice of cheetah. Define vocalize method. Print chirp. And end class cheetah. Start child class leopard. Class leopard of cat. Leopard is child class and cat is parent class. Now override the vocalize method to change its output or behavior for the voice of leopard. Override the vocalize method and print roar. Similarly. Create another child class, line of cat. Line is child class and cat is parent class. And override the vocalize method to change to change its output or behavior for the voice of line. Define vocalize self print roar and class of line. Create an object of child class theta and initialize the values of attributes, mass, lifespan, and speed. Theta is an instance of class theta and initialize the value seventy two. To mass and twelve to lifespan and one twenty to speed. Create an object of child class leopard and initialize the values of attribute mass, lifespan, and speed. Similarly, create an object of child class line and initialize the values of mass, lifespan, and speed. Mass assigned to ninety, lifespan assigned to seventeen, and speed assigned to fifty-eight. If we call the vocalize method now, we should get different outputs. If we call the vocalize method now, we should get different outputs. Cheetah call vocalize method. Leopard instance call vocalize method. Leopard line dot vocalize methods and run the cell. Cheetah chirp. Leopard roar and line also roar. Overriding init method. In the previous topic, we overrode the vocalize method of our cat base class in our cheetah line and leopard subclasses. In this topic, we shall see how to override the init method. A lot of big cats have a pattern in their coat. They have spots or strips. Let's add this to our cheetah subclass. Exercise: Overriding the init method. Init method. To add an attribute in this exercise, we shall override the init method and add a spotted underscore quote attribute. Override the initializer method and add the spotted underscore quote attribute. Define car. Define cat class as above. Class cat. Define the constructor of cat class as above. And define vocalize method same as above. Define define print underscore facts method same as above. Create child or subclass same as in the above cell. Create child or subclass same as in the above cell. Class cheetah of cat. Override init method or constructor method for child class cheetah. Define under, double underscore init double underscore under init pass mass attribute lifespan attribute and speed attribute. Self dot spot underscore quote is equal to true. This is an other attribute. Self dots spotted underscore quote set to true. Add new attribute to child class cheetah. Define the vocalize method. Define vocalize method. Print chirp. 
Unfortunately, this overrides the previous implementation and replaces it with our new one. So, when we initialize the cheetah subclass, it would not add the mass in kg, life in years, and speed in kilometer per hours attributes. It will only add the spotted underscore quote attribute to the instance of cheetah class. Run the when it is the newly modified cheetah class, it should raise an error upon trying to access the original attributes that it had before we overrode the init method. Create an instance of child class cheetah and trying to access and set attributes of parent class. Run the cell. Try to access mass underscore in underscore kg, mass in kg attributes with the help of cheetah instance. Cheetah dot mass in kg. Cheetah object has no attributes mass and kg because we have override the init method in the child class. Cheetah object has no, this is also overwritten of init method in the child class. Access this. It will also raise an error due to the overwritten of init method. Inert method. This one. True. Its main cheetah dot spotted underscore quote is accessible. Unfortunately, this overrides the previous implementation and replaced it with our new one. So, when we initialize the cheetah subclass, it would not add the mass in kg, life in span, years, and speed in kilometer per hour attributes. It will only add the spotted underscore quote attribute to the instance. Initialize the newly modified cheetah class, it should raise an error error upon trying to access the original attributes that it had before we override the init method. Call the super, super class initializer method in the cheetah subclass initializer. Create child class cheetah from parent class cat, class cheetah of cat, define the constructor of child class and also call the init or constructor method of parent class cat. This is the, syn this is the syntax of calling a parent constructor of parent class in a child class cat dot double underscore in it double underscore of self comma mass lifespan comma speed call constructor of parent class actually this day actually this statement call the constructor of parent class cat self dot spotted underscore code is equal to true set the child class attribute spot underscore code to true Override vocalize method of parent class cat. Define vocalize print chuff and subclass cheetah. Create an instance of child class cheetah. Call vocalize method through instance. Call vocalize method through instance of subclass cheetah. However, doing this hard codes the superclass name and in case we need to change the name of the cat class, we had we had have to change it in multiple places. Python provides a cleaner way of doing this through the built-in super method. We use super to access inherited methods from a parent class that has been overwritten in the child class. Call the super class initializer method by using the super method. Create child class cheetah from parent class cat, class cheetah of cat, define the constructor of child class and also call the init or constructor method of parent class cat car constructor of parent class cat set child class attribute spotted code to true define vocalize methods and when we when we instantiate a cheetah instance we say we see that our cat superclass implementation is preserved weight 7 to 2 kg has a lifespan of 12 years and can run at a maximum speed of 60 km per hour. At the same time, our new implementation is also added. Run the cell. True. 